Hello, I took my break, <clears throat> and I'm back to play a little more for the day. Same day as the last video, even though it'll be uploaded on a different day. I needed to go northwest, I think. Ooh. Wonder if I could take a picture. Oh. Do I have to have it selected or is there just a button I could press? No, I bet I have to have it out. Oh. Oh wow, there's like so many combinations to this one. This one seems pretty good. Alright, we'll do this. Yeah, we'll do this one. Oh wait. Damn it, I gotta... I could wake the winds, right? In the boat. If you couldn't, that'd be kind of lame. Oh, I was already going northwest. I wonder if it set that for me already, or if that was the original direction. I think that's the Pictobox Island, right? And you can only get there from having an extended magic meter, I think. End game content. What? How do I view the map? From... What the hell? No. Can I not view the map? Oh. Okay, that's what I needed to do. There we go, perfect. Wait. Yeah. I feel like maybe I should wait to get the fishes because as each island I go to, uh, the fish will give me advice on the island and if I need to be there then it's better for me to hear that advice fresh when he talks about it. It's right there though. This island... There's nothing I can do about this island yet. Oh wait, no, but if I get the fish... Um, I could travel back through fast, like, the warp, right? So, yeah, never mind. And I should know most about these islands anyways. So tell me, have you heard of the golden set of Trump Triumph Forks? It's right there, I tell you, the article genuine in that house. If you want it, you better go in there and scour the place from floor to ceiling. And that's all the info I've got to offer. If you want to hear it again, you'll have to throw some more bait. All right. I 
feel like the GameCube controller is just such a uh, easier controller to play this game with. The gamepad and the Pro controller are a little, a little too much. Too many buttons, and the buttons are all the same size, so it's it's a little bit harder to distinguish each one from the other, and you know. That little play toy GameCube controller was just so perfect. They had it right on the money. I feel like I need to go just a tad bit. Yeah, I'm almost, I almost need to go west. I might as well go a little straighter and then change to go west. Yeah, let's change now. Oh, that's interesting. I guess they changed that a bit too. So far from playing this game, it maybe it's just uh, because I'm not used to it, but so far I do like, I think I like the GameCube a little bit better. I think it's a little bit more about just the controls. Um, yeah, it's mostly probably just the controls. This game looks better, but that game feels better, if you know what I'm saying. But that last fight, boss fight was really cool so it's not too off just a little oh god not those guys Why is there so many? Jesus. I need to grab something real quick. I'm just going to leave it going. Until we get there. I need to take something. Some drugs. Look, Mirka, do you see it? What has happened to this place? What is the meaning of this? The island, it is. We are too late. I remember when I first played this game, I couldn't get past this part because it glitched out on me. I knew we had a precious little time, but I never suspected how little. A great water spirit named Jaboon once lived here, but no sign of him remains. Ho oh, there, Miraku. Yeah, this is where it glitched out, and then... I think I had to start the whole playthrough over again. Just to uh, get past it. Because I couldn't, for some reason, get past it every time I reset the game. So you're here, I've been looking for you. Are you by chance seeking the great spirit Jaboon? I'm sorry to report that. <clears throat> Jaboon can no longer be found here. Just look at this place. 
has been torn to pieces. I suppose this, too, is the work of the shadow in the Forsaken Fortress. Ganon. But fear not, Jaboon was able to flee this island before it was attacked. He is in a safer abode now. Would you like to guess where that abode may be? On the island where you were born. Why is Link so afraid of that? Answer. That's great news. Yet even if you were to go to outset now, you would not be able to see Jaboon. The cave where he hides is sealed with a mighty stone slab that repels all who try to pass it. Why not even the pirates with their mighty ships could get in? I must apologize, Miriku. I thought if anyone would know of your whereabouts, it would be the pirates. I told them this tale without as much of a thought for the consequences. I don't know what they'd hope to get, but they immediately set sail for Outset Island and tried to break into the cave. I mean, it was a good thought that I'd be with the pirates. It is lucky they could not gain entrance. I have heard that they were last spotted on Windfall Island, but doing what I do not know. If you wish to see Jaboon, I think you better search for the pirates on Windfall Island. What an eerie isle this is. Everywhere else boasts clear skies and calm seas, but this place suffers under dark clouds and rain. Falu must have been right when he asked me to bring word of Jaboon to you. He called this island cursed. I would counsel against staying here longer than you have to. If that is your decision, I have told you of Jaboon, so my task is complete. Yeah, I know what to do. Later. The sea spirit has lived through the trials of many long years. He must have caught wind of Ganon's attack beforehand. If we are to believe the words of the Rito Postman, then the pirate knows something about the cave where Jaboon hides. Why don't we go first to Windfall and search for them? I remember I thought, <clears throat> I don't think I read the dialogue here, because there is quite a lot. I used to just try to play the game without um, reading stuff, because I don't want to read shit. Um, for the longest time, I didn't know what to do, and so I spent like hours searching the island just to see if there's like some secret or something, because I didn't know where to go. They probably remind you again in the um, the Wii U version, but I don't think they do in the other version. It's like you have to pay attention a little bit, like old games. Instead of most games where they just keep repeating things and giving you checkpoints. So you don't, you could just like space out. Yeah, I remember that part used to give me the longest, the, the hardest time. Because I just didn't read it and then it, I also had a game that would glitch out there. Oops. Oh damn it, it's uh, thundering. Hopefully that guy doesn't attack. Or that octopus or whatever. I think I'm gonna go somewhere after this. After this playthrough. I'm gonna go get some food or something. I don't really have any food here to eat. I've aided it all. Why is there just a single shark here? I don't really remember this happening. I don't really want to kill it. If I kill it, I think I get a belt. Though. It's not even close, I'm not even moving. Oh shit. Uh, drop them. 
my phone. Hopefully it didn't fuck it up too much. This shark is so stupid, just leave. It's less threatening than those giant um, flying enemies, propeller enemies. Do I, I need a, in order to do the fast travel, I need to speak to the brother of that wind god guy and defeat him, and I need a bow to do that, I think. It is just as the postman told us, the pirate ship has stopped here to avoid drawing the attention to the townsfolk. It looks pretty noticeable from there. I know not what they are researching, but if they are hoping to get their hands on Jabu's sacred gem, I doubt they would tell you anything directly if you were to ask them. Mirikru, I think you should try to find out what the pirates are up to without them finding out about you. I really like the pirate ship, it looks really cool. I think I can get something if I... Or wait, no, I can't... Wait... I need a password to get in there, and then they say the password right. Oh, fuck. We'll find out. What was that? How do you treat a shark? Oh. Treat a shark. Yeah. We gotta get the password from the sh the parts. God damn it. Oh wait, is that guy up? No, he's not. I need that guy though. But does it stay dark? Uh, we'll see. I need that song from that guy. Oh yeah, we need to go to the um to the bomb shop. Ooh. Mail for me. Good evening. You have one letter, here's your letter. If you wish to be a true swordsman, find some knight's crest oh, didn't already get that? I feel like the guy in here, when a lot of people play this game, they see him being robbed and they say whether or not they think it's fine or whatever. I don't know. I feel like he's scamming people. He's doing, he's like, it's like he has a monopoly of something and he, um, he knows it so he can raise the prices to an absurd amount. So I don't really care what happens to him. Or... If he gets robbed, I mean, I don't really want him to die, but yeah. Looks weird, too. He looks like a poodle or something. Look, don't be mad at us. It's not our fault that we absolutely gotta have bombs to get the treasure we're after. How about you just think of it as payback for the nasty little monopoly you've been- Yeah, exactly! He's been running a fucking monopoly. Fuck this guy. So I bet you're thinking it was foolhardy to ask pirates to pay such an outrageous price, huh? Yep, I bet you are. 
you know Gonzo still can't get over that bit of fast talking you pulled to get that information out of the postman. <clears throat> that was smooth. I tell you, the minute I set my eyes on that Miruku, I just knew he was hiding something back at outset, yeah? So when I saw that postman, I just pretended like I was all worried about the kid and stuff, and presto he spills the beans. Good work Gonzo, really just top notch. It's funny though. I'm thinking this is maybe the first time you've shown such wit, such cunning. You know with your cunning and Miss Tetra's smarts, if you two got married and had kids, that kid would have would be the greatest pirate to ever sail the seas. Yup, the greatest. You idiot. <laughs> His stupid face. Shut your mouth. Or keep your mouth shut. Yeah, don't be so stupid. <laughs> Miss Tetra, are you listening to this nitwit? Can't you dock him some pay or something? Quit goofing off, both of you. Keep your childish jokes to yourself and get those bombs back to the ship. The second you're done loading them up, we're setting sail for Outset Island. What? Miss, we have to leave immediately, but it's been so long since we're on shore. We need to fill our bellies with some good eating, yeah? How about we grub tonight and shove off tomorrow morning instead? I mean, uh, I'm fine either way, of course. Whatever you say is fine, miss, is what I meant to say. It's just that the boys were so excited to come to town, yeah? And I can't help but think it would be awful hard on them to leave us so soon without a proper layover. So what say we set sail tomorrow, yeah? What do you say, miss? That treasure isn't going anywhere. You're with me, right boys? <laughs> Who's for a night of fun? Yeah, they're not gonna say anything. You're all fools. Do you know that? You saw that demolished island. You saw the senseless destruction. We have to hurry to onset or the same thing could happen there. Sounds like she's trying to protect the island. Not to be disrespectful, but by the sound of things, you're worried more about that island than the treasure, miss. Don't be ridiculous. I want, you know, the treasure. I always wondered, does she, does she know who she is? I feel like she does. Alright, fine, have it your way. We can leave town tomorrow, you big babies. But we're setting sail at first sight, so no sleeping in, understood. Like, her, the idea of her is so confusing. When it's, you know, all is, all is said and done. Say there, brother, what was today's password again? Mako, are you serious? You forget already? You're so useless. Today's password is Chumli, yeah? Remember? You know that Nico won't let you in if you don't say it exactly right. And he's real picky about it, so I'll say it once more. The password is Chumli, yeah? Chumli, eh? Chumli. With the H. Chumli. Yeah, Tetra is, is so cool of a character, but it's also like, I have like suspicions that she knows the deal or something. For her to have that small sense of sympathy for Outset Island and Link and stuff, you know, something's a little off. Can't I? Oh, I thought I was supposed to push those. Am I supposed to like? What the hell am I supposed to do? Free the guy? It definitely looks like there's something behind here. No. Nope. It seems like I'm supposed to free him. Or not. I know, I think I know the bombs are on the ship, but like, why does this look, 
like it's something. It looks like there's something behind here. That must be just uh, decorations for the bombs, even though they let you climb up it. Alright, let's get the bombs. Let's get the bombs and dip. How do you treat a shark? Just to be extra careful, we'll put a capital. Comely. The H is silent. Ooh, I can go in here. Yeah, she has to know. Look at this. She knows what she's doing. Yeah, look at this. There's no way she doesn't know. And she's just... I, I, I think I originally thought that she... Had, like, uh, her memory wiped or something. Is that supposed to be Impa or something? And it's only... It only gets, like... Revealed or uh, her brain gets awoken when uh, She's in the right place or the right events happen. Oh meter group my old swabby meter crew, So you're alive all the other pirates said you got done in by the bird monster in the forsaken fortress Never mind what I thought you're alive. Oh, I get it now. You came back because you missed me so much I Had no idea you wanted to be my swabby so badly. I see I see after you left, I went back to being the bottom rug on the ladder, which is why I'm stuck here while everyone else is having fun eating and stuff. And you're just here to starve. I guess being so worshipped by my swabby ought to cheer me up. Alright, why don't we set you to your next test? Yeah, let's do this. No need to explain. I feel like I could do it in one go this time. Is he locking himself in? The hell? Okay. It's like he has that much faith in me. I think the only test in this is just to see if you can rock it back and forth. What the hell was that? It does not accept gentle rocks as rocks. Let's do this again. Shit. I'm trying to do it fast, but then that's messing me up. But that's the whole name of the game. Just give me a bomb. As soon as I have a bomb inventory, I can get more bombs. Seems like landing on those does nothing for you. Because you can't... You can't get back up once you end on the top of those crates, it looks like anyways. Right? Yeah. Wait. No. 
Yeah, there's nothing. These are useless. Wait, what the hell? You can. I think I'm gonna go for this actually, since I don't have enough time. Yeah, no. I don't think I've ever done that before. I feel stupid. If you can do that though, how useful is it? Oh yeah, I forgot you can just um, swing around, but like, you don't need to halt. I'm so used to the old game, I forgot about this. This makes things so much quicker. Yeah, I feel stupid. Even stupider. One thing I don't like though is it seems like you can't really um, maneuver the camera as much as the old game used to allow. I remember being able to look around when I'm swinging <clears throat> with the camera. What you gotta be, you did it already? You're incredible. This isn't good, I've never even passed this test. How could he do it so quickly and make it look so easy? And if I give this to him, everyone will know for sure I'll be busted. Okay. You're the best swabby of all time. I guess I'll just give you the bombs. Go on, take them. Just don't tell anyone, okay? I'm serious, real serious. Okay? Okay. texture on that bomb. It looks kind of a little different. That's mighty courageous of you trying to steal treasure from pirates. I suppose I should be shocked, but I'm more amazed that you managed to survive after being tossed out of that tower. From the look on your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet. You don't give much things things much thought though, do you? You just rush in never thinking how badly things could go for you. Like just now, the only reason you got what you did was because we left a simple minded little rat like Nico behind to look after things. Oh, there he is. <laughs> no one else would have parted with our treasure so easily, I assure you. And just how do you intend to use those bombs anyway? Don't tell me you're going after Jaboon's treasure too. Right now, Jaboon is hiding in a cave at the back of the island you were born on. But the entrance is blocked by a giant stone doorway. You can't get in without breaking down the door. We're going to relax in town and eat our fill of whatever this town has to offer. But we'll be leaving for onset first thing in the morning. If you manage to find Jaboon tonight, then I guess you win. But if you take too long, we'll come sailing right by you tomorrow morning and believe you me. Oh. And believe me, you didn't get all of our bombs. You better be quick, kid. What do you have to say for yourself? Well, awesome. You have a stone just like the one that Miss Tetra has. Hey, how do you use that thing? Can you talk to Miss Tetra through that? Man, you're so lucky. I guess so. It's not that lucky to have it. Or that special. Where'd the boat go? The hell? He was just there, though. Oh, he moved. 
without telling me. Good evening, you have one letter from Miriko. Here's your letter. Notice from the Beetle Shop. It's time for our semi-annual Big Chance Extravaganza. We have a new product that has burst onto the scene bombs. How did they get bombs? Did they steal it as well? If you have an extra special sale on this choice item for a limited time only, you know where to find us by checking the enclosed Beetle Shop ship chart. Visit a Beetle Shop ship near you today. Don't miss this huge opportunity. How many bombs do I have? Uh, max amount. Yeah, I don't need to go there. The fuck? Am I, st am I stuck? Can't go underneath the port. Or the dock. And you don't have anything. Well done, our preparations are complete. If what the girl says is true, the... Wait, what? The pirates won't be leaving until morning. How did he know that? Does he have this stone? We must meet with Jaboon and get the pearl from him. Did she talk to him or something? She probably knows. She probably did, too. Shit. Alright. And we got a long way to go to get there. We'll just go south. They probably did that so that you um, can run into all these islands. But I think I'll do that in the next part. Uh, get it ready. We'll line it up. That's good enough. And we're gonna stop for right now. I do not want to fight whatever is trying to fight me. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.